even legal? But, the, but in my, we went from Walter Cronkite, mm -hmm. basically, to this guy, Joe Rogan, who believes in dragons. He, I checked it. He, he believes, believes in dragons? He believes in dragons. Did you triple force and, that? <laughs> yes, I did. And he also thinks that they, dragons, like I guess like dinosaur -y type type of animals, yeah. roamed the earth when people did. So I mean, is it really that far off? Because what is a dragon, really? I mean, a pterodactyl, that could be considered a dragon. I mean, we got the bones and everything of these animals that look like dragons. And once you go back in history, like in China specifically, over in that area, the Far East, they got dragons all over the place. All it, it, It'd be a dragon right next to a regular dog or something like this in paintings. So it's not that difficult to really believe. But you're making it seem like he's just an idiot that will believe anything. So this is the type of really, really bad information that's going out well, there. Well, in defense, there are some really but good news. it's possible news. that Donald Trump did roam the earth when dinosaurs <laughs> were here. There are some really good news uh, kind of influencer types, and I think it's great that... So let's get some of those types. Who, who are you going to say is a... Okay, so the whole fact that what's her name joy behart or something like that decides to go or not i don't know if that's her name my bad i don't know people got different names and different acts going i don't know who the heck anybody is but yeah that person that was just talking about joe rogan talking about he believes in dragons all right so this is how funny this is how the angels like to play the fallen angels and their and their and legion you're watching legion right now and and they're 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 very good at what they do because they keep the audience in in babylon first off it's like they're trying to warn you in one way it's like okay we warned you but you don't get the warning because of the way that they delivered it now i always told you first off i always told you joe rogan joe ragan joe rogan joe ragan okay dragon I always told you, JRE, Dragon, okay? Always going live on LSD, Leviathan, Satan, Dragon, going live, live, Leviathan. Okay, so the point is, I've always told you this for at least four years now. You guys were late and you know, you're allowing these cats to, you know, control the narrative and deliver it to you on their terms. Now what they're doing is they're telling you right to your face what I told you. They're telling you his name right next to them saying the word dragon. They're saying Joe Rogan, Dragon. Joe Rogan believes in dragons. Joe Rogan believes in dragons. They keep telling you this, but I told you that the word is the same. His name represents dragon. They're, the thing is, either they're warning you or they're, you know, they're just as dumb as a lot of people are and they just let words come out of their mouth and they don't even know it because that's how the fallen angels and legion play. They use, they go between man and man don't even realize they're being used as a tool. It could be right in their face and they're still blind. Okay, it could be right in their mouth and they're still blind. No taste, no flavor. They don't understand. They can't tell the difference. They're numb, you know? So the point is, these people are hired to be in your face because they they will just do what the, the what they will send the messages that the that legion and the fallen angels want right and cast it right over the audience and just like the just like the people hosting it you know what i mean they're just tools and the audience becomes a tool also because of relaying the messages and stuff like that but somebody's got to be able to decode it and let you know okay what you're actually hearing and what you're seeing 
is one and the same. It's like when I tell you you're speaking English. No, you're speaking Hebrew when you think you're speaking English. You're told you're speaking English, but you're actually speaking Hebrew. And that is where a lot of people will get lost. They're like, oh, what do you mean? I'm like, well, you see, you know how snakes have a forked tongue, you know, and the Bible warns you about a double-minded man, you know what I mean? It means you're not whole, you're not holy, you know what I mean, such, such and such, because you blasphemy and, and you don't recognize and understand, the lack understanding, you don't have the love of the Father, which is the, 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 the word, the Hebrew, the salvation, okay, the rock. So the point is the truth in your mouth, like, because you can't, you don't, you're blind to it. And that's Babylon. That's the point. That's the point of Babylon is blindness, spiritual blindness. Like you can have a bunch because we speak the language of money. We speak a language of, uh, of lust, the language of, of sin. It's the language of legion. It's legion. The, the name of the word of what we call language, every culture in every country doesn't use the word language. Do you hear what I am saying? They use a different word, okay? We use the word language, okay? Language represents legion, okay? Okay, so when you say the word language, you are calling on the word legion. You are speaking dragon, forked tongue, to lie hidden. Okay, when you say English, okay, you're talking angels and demons. Like some Da Vinci Code stuff. Okay, you're talking Anglo-Saxon, angels of Satan, and you're talking Latin, legion. Roman Latin, Roman legion. Okay. Pig Latin, pig legion. Okay. Do, do you see? Oh, now you see. Now you see. Yeah. Because you're blind. There's so many different ways that I could break that down to, but if I give you three different ways to break it down to, there's no denying it because there's three different levels that you're not seeing. You know what I mean? You could see one way and be blind to six others. Or you could see six others and be blind to one. And that's even worse. That's even worse. It's even worse. Because that means one will be uh, annihilated. You know what I mean? Or it will be harder, even harder to find. You know what I mean? Because you'd be so confident. This is the confidence. Of, they'll give you a lot, but then they'll own that little corner. You know, they call it capitalism. <laughs> they'll capitalize on some shit, and you own nothing. You know what I mean? And when, when they take that corner, it's the cornerstone that you rejected, and it's capitalism. It's the capstone. And you, you rejected it. And that's what I'm telling you. The corner stone the basic building block of what you call language is hebrew period no matter what language you're speaking okay so what you got to realize is like there's a lot of lies they try to tell you even with your words they tell you the truth like i said you're speaking hebrew but then they, they, they capitalize on the tithe. You know what I mean? They tax you. Everything. Look, well, how do they not tax you? Look at everything that's physical in this world that they tax. And then you think you're living life no matter how big or small you are. All right? But when I say to you, you're being taxed on every breath that you speak because you speak this language. You just can't believe me for some reason. It's hard to believe me. It's hard to believe. It's easier to convince somebody that they, uh, 
It's easier to, to fool somebody than it is to convince them that they have been fooled. That is the that is the common uh, the common uh, warning nowadays on 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 the web. But even you guys who say that have trouble believing me when I'm telling you. I'm giving you example, prime example after prime example after prime example because I do this. It's muscle memory, baby. Muscle memory. It's grace. I do this with ease. I do this as a living. It's my every word, every breath is focused on like, what am I producing here? Am I being taxed? You know? And that's what people don't understand. I respect what people say. If they understand what they're talking about. And if they don't understand what they're talking about, I pity them. And I try to offer some type of relief. <laughs> Shoot. You know what I mean? I don't like to see people suffer. What, what kind of judgment is that for me to walk past? Yeah, when I'm, when I'm going to need help, the big guy, you know, my big bro going to walk past me because I did it to someone less than, that, that had less mind, less capability, less dexterity over their own life than I have over theirs. No, bro, you need control over your life. You don't need to be relying on me. And that's what I'm talking about when I say I have control over somebody's life. People rely on you over and over and over. No, you need to learn to walk on your own. You need to learn to save yourself. You need to learn to not have people worry about you. Because that is damn near a sin. You want to put people's mind at ease and rest people's mind at ease. You don't want people's minds to be... Um, constantly worried about you because once their 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 house is divided now their their focus their attention their love everything is divided now and it becomes a habit and a habitat for evil evil thoughts and intentions and stuff like that and that's what i'm saying like you don't understand how the loose fear lucifer happens inside of you it runs rampant because you don't understand what you are loose, what you are, what you are loosening, and you are binding in the in the words that you speak around you and within you. It's a double-edged sword. You hear what you say, even if you don't understand it, and that's the problem. They tax you so that they can come back in constantly. So they, obviously, it's some. It's it's not something that you're physically running around doing. It's something that you are mentally programmed to do, okay? And you are verbally accountable for it. You know what I mean? And people don't understand that your verbal account is your true uh, karma, if I'm not mistaken. When it comes to karma, like, you know, I've, I've come that honesty is the best karma. Like, you know what I mean? Like, shh. Somebody wants to come against you, like I can rest at ease. Like I, hey, I haven't been after nobody doing anything. I've been minding my own business, you know, such and such. If you up against me, up against you know some karma, you know what I mean? I can, I can let this slide. But at the same time, if you take it too far, you know what I mean? Like I might have to defend myself. I'll still, you know, save face. I'm not gonna hurt you, you know what I mean? I'm gonna try not to hurt you, but I'm gonna let it be known that you know, hey. You're going up against karma, and I'm very smooth with it. You know what I mean? Like I'm, I'm walking meditation with this stuff. You know what I mean? Like, so even, even if you catch me off guard, you know what I mean? Because I'm just like, yeah, that was back in the day when I was like loose. You know, I was a loose spirit, like watching these spirits run around loose up in the atmosphere. So you know what I mean? So I'm like. I was a loose spirit one time, like, what the heck, you know what I mean? I got caught off guard one time, ha, ah, somebody popped me in the face, be like, hold on, hold on, you know what I mean? Like, what the heck, all right, you know, I don't deserve that, but okay, karma gonna get you, you know what I mean? That's it. And there's nothing to laugh about, I apologize, man, I love that brother, but you know, it's just some. I never touched him, I didn't even know what happened to him, I never sent anybody after him, but you know, it's, it was in, Rapid secession, as soon as he did it to me, soon after, he wouldn't no more. And that's how the most high gets you and lets you know you need to put yourself in a place where people won't strike you because even then you'll have guilt on your mind because of, you know, 
Like, you should be putting yourself around the, the, the you know, a, a more protected area to challenge yourself to not be in that type of situation, first off. You need to protect your mind so you don't get concussed and lose that, so that you don't be influenced and then die of some type of viral challenge. Because that's how influences happen. Influenza. And then you die of a viral challenge, something that challenged your system, challenged your being, okay? But that's how the word is. The word is a double-edged sword. And that's the whole point of Legion, man. They want you to cut yourself on your own sword. You know what I mean? They want you to fall on your own sword, Shinigami type style. You know, these cats want to get you. In the bars, that's when people start slurring their words, and that's when and the bar, the law, and all this stuff get involved. And yeah, man, you get trapped off in that. Think about it, bro. They're judging you for your word. Oh, they ain't seen you step, they ain't seen you walk. They don't know how you move, but if, you're, if your speech is a little slurred, then people want to, you know, try to. That's when the demon starts, you know, splitting the mind. Be like, yeah, coming on out. You know what I mean? Hey. They want to have fun all of a sudden. Yeah, you know, he want to be the nice guy. He want to be junk. When they junk, usually people are nice. That's how people think. And then people want to get down and be happy. That's why you don't see me with none of that mess. You ain't going to hear me running around with no bottles and stuff like that. None of that mess. No. Nah. That's some spirits inside of the bottles. Them loose spirits getting, you know, bottles get popped open. That's loose. And there you go. <laughs> People get knocked down. That's how it is when them spirits come out. They coming out for blood. They coming out for good. They want they want to be out for good. Every bottle popped is another spirit loose. Lucifer. Okay. And the point is, you need to know how to control it. You need to know how to cap it. You need to know, like I said, it's it's know where the limit is know where lucifer belongs <laughs> and where your mind and consciousness should stay constant that lucifer will knock you unconscious and that's how your butt ain't been end up on a science operation the scientific unconscious be on a scientific operation after that a real operation operating table yeah you be on an operating table all right Shit, be in another country, Shanghai, fighting for some war that you ain't even involved in. It's the world we live in, bro. Like, people, you gotta, you'll be a loose spirit. You'll be a loose spirit. Like, they come from far away to get you. Look at the back of the freaking labels on the stuff that you drink. Sometimes it's not produced anywhere near where you're from, and you be wondering why you acting different. All right? You know, the, the local drink local so that they can have a local or familiar spirit. You know what I mean? So people know how to deal with that. You deal with some other stuff, and they gonna, other locals going to realize, okay, what's this all about? Uh, it's pit against you in the first place. It's planted against you. It's programmed against you in the first place. Uh, you got to understand how this is. Just like these cats right here are speaking just like that, speaking their spirits, coming on out, loose spirits, and they're letting it loose. And they're, and they're like atom smashing because they got this little circle going around. This little, uh, they got their little, you know, you know, view thing going on, you know. So they get to like ping pong these little spears back and forth, these spear back and forth. And they like, and, and it's, they're letting you see it. It's like they're playing with it right in front of you. You know what I mean? For its sake, you know, they're doing more worship to them than they are uh, talking down on them. And that's where Anthony Brian Logan gets caught up in because he thinks that he, he gets caught up in the charade. That's where a lot of you guys that say, you know, oh, well, uh, it's easier to fool somebody than it is to let them know that they've been fooled. You even get caught up in the charade. That's what I'm saying. You get caught up in the charade. It's a charade, bro. These cats are doing this because there's boundaries that they have to. There's there's rituals they have to they have to do in order to cross certain boundaries. 
And these are signs and symbols and times and dates, seals. And that's how deep in, in this shit you're going. The end. You know what I mean? Like, this is... When they're talking about dragons... And they're just openly just calling people out with the names. Like, is he actually named that from his from birth? Or is that some... Uh, some type of operating table name you know what i mean operations hey he liked to get drunk back in the day he liked to scrap and fight who knows probably plenty of operating tables you know shoot be like smoking aces out there but anyway like you've already had like shit come on man come on that's what it's all about charlie's angels you know putting on freaking fake names and covers uh andy kaufman and freaking uh jim carrey type stuff you know what i mean just play it off you know what i mean just whatever they feel like you know what i mean they 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 put you into it and Next thing you know, you're living a life. Like I say, if you can go off and fight a war, there's different types of war. War on information is what they're putting you up. You're fighting a war for somebody, and you don't even know it. Like I said, you believe in the charade. You fall for the charade, and you go off willingly, gun ho. Because of lack of knowledge, my people are destroyed. So you guys got to understand, like I said, up top, what is really being produced? What are you being taxed on? You need to know the whole story instead of falling for, you know, like I said, whatever these cats decide to give you. you no, know, you need to know it before life brings it to you. Because if, if you could practice with it before life brings it to you, you could survive it. But if you don't, man, you got a less, <laughs> a more chance of losing. Let's just say that. You know what I mean? So I'm just saying, man. Like you, you need to, you need to have a relationship. That's practice. You need to have a relationship. You need to have an understanding with the word that comes out of your mouth. You need to know that every word has a history and a root. And if you're really gonna use it today, you need to go and look it up. I suggest that. And that's not. I shouldn't say suggest that. That's what I do, and that's what I preach. That's what I'm. That's what I'm about. You know what I mean? That's what I teach. Is the is the love of the spirit of understanding. You know what I mean? The Holy Spirit of understanding. I have Ruach Kakma Kadesh. Kadash and Kadosh. You know what I mean? And that's the love of the Father. That's the that is the, the root of 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 Jesse, the Rock of David. That is Yashaya, the salvation. That is the grace of man. It is all together. That's why the Holy Spirit is such and such and such and such and such and such. Be all like, how can he be? How can he be? How can he be the Holy Spirit? This because you don't understand. You don't understand. You have not the understanding of the Father, and that is blasphemy, guys. That is the highest, and and, and it's so subtle. The, the devil is so subtle at doing this with you guys. You guys are nationally renowned at at pridefully like man it's pride bro pride come before the fall proud of the way you speak but have not the understanding and they mock you to your face like that just like this a dragon right next to a regular dog or something like this in painting to this guy joe rogan um <laughs> Legal note calling her. You guys would never tell us a lie. Now, would you? And, by everybody. Yeah, I mean, if, if we're wrong, we have, you know, the legal note here. Mm -hmm. um, <laughs> legal note calling her legal note is hilarious. The human legal <laughs> note. But the, in my, we went from Walter Cronkite, mm -hmm. basically, to this guy, Joe Rogan, who believes in dragons. He, I checked it. He, he believes, believes in dragons. He believes in dragons. Did you triple force and, that? Yes, I did. And he also thinks that they, dragons, like I guess like dinosaur type type of animals, yeah. roamed the earth when people did. So.
I mean, is it really that far off? Because what is a dragon really? I mean, a pterodactyl, that could be considered. I'll say okay so when they say walter walter is kind of like a dragon also <laughs> look man the way that they doing this bro i'll tell you a secret real quick i'm gonna pause this okay so when they say like walter think about it man you guys when you say ice wall ice wall that's the damn dragon, okay? That's the Antarctica right arm. That's the right hand of the dragon. Wall, dragon, ball. Wall is ball, okay? Tor is Thor, wall Tor. Ball Thor, okay. You understand? That's Voldemort. Okay, what do you want? What, what else can I tell you, bro? George, George, uh, George of South Georgia and the sandwich, uh, South Sandwich Islands. Okay, Jorge, George, okay? You gotta think about it, bro. Like when they say like uh, like Walmart, okay? That that's that also stands for like like I said, anything with wall stands for ball. That's why even Trump is 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 all about ball with the wall. You know what I mean? Like that's it's just a part of this. It's, it's just a part of the whole thing, bro. I told you the behemoth and the dragon, ball and the leviathan. Or the Bohemoth and the Leviathan, a ball, and uh, Satan or Lucifer, or dragon, whatever you want to call it. But yeah, they're they're it's it's the yin and the yang of the earth. So it's it's a they pitch the words back and forth. That's what you got to understand. They they speak when they speak they speak a pantheon. They make our language language is a pantheon. It is legion. And they put it out of order or put themselves in higher order than the actual Aheb Ruach Kodesh, Kakma Kodesh, which is what you're calling the Hebrew. They put themselves in a higher order than Hebrew in all languages around Hebrew in order to blasphemy Hebrew. They allow you to have it and make you think, oh, yeah, we worship Hebrew. Oh, yeah, yeah, we worship the Jews. Oh, yeah, yeah. No, that's just, uh, that's what they call that a... Uh, that's a bait and switch and a controlled opposition. That's why when Obama went over to talk to freaking Netanyahu Neptune, he told him, uh, oh, I'm the little Satan, we're the little Satan, and you're the big Satan. Okay, they, he told you to your face. They called each other Satan to let you know, okay, I'm a head of Satan and you're a head of Satan. Now I'm a little head and you're a big head. Okay, the little horn, and the big horn, the little horn boasting, okay, the horns of the dragon, the horn on the dragon boasting, okay, do you understand? The, the horns on the beast, do you understand? In the book of Revelations, do you understand? Are the presidents, are the leaders, are, are the so-called putting self-proclaimed leaders, little horns, big horns, okay, do you understand? Battles of little horns and big horns, do you understand? Okay, it, it speaks volumes on all languages. Trumpets and horns. Trumpets is a tramp, 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 trample your ass. You know what I mean? That's death, trampling, the herd, the beast. What are you talking about? Four leggeds, trump, trample. You know, a snake is not gonna trump or trample you. Well, a serp, a, a dragon could trample you, but you know, but uh, angels and, and giants usually trample you or herds. It masses, legion. So it's all in the same language. Highlander stuff, you know what I mean? You gotta understand. The Trump card, the tramp card. <laughs> like, the trample your butt. That's, it's done, it's stepping on you. Bug, squish, 1984, Trump, okay. It was the symbol was the boot on top of a person's head. That is the literal term of trample, to tramp. Trap, tramp, stomp, stamp, trump. Okay, you get it. The trump of approval, the stamp of approval. Okay, it's kind of making sense to you now. Okay, it's not. Uh, and a trumpet is like, is is 
what we're calling a musical instrument in English, <laughs> a trumpet. <laughs> it's not a trumpet in Hebrew. A, a shofar is like a C4. This is like a bird. A C4. A C4. In, in English, a C4 is a dang dynamite blast. A blast, okay? A big blast. That's what you should be scared of. C4. Uh, a, a condor. Freaking AC 130 or some shit. <laughs> You know what I mean? That's Antichrist also, by the way. Because it's, yeah, AC Antichrist 130. Okay, so you got to understand, they, they have ways of putting this out over your head. Ruling with dominion in your mouth before they do it on earth. Because as it, in, as it is in heaven, so it is on earth. So you're like, oh, in heaven... But then on earth, but it's in your mouth before it's on earth. That is what you have to understand. Your mouth is like a dock. You decide what you allow to give birth to and come out. It should be your decision given by the most high. But if it is not your decision, it is not conscience, it is not consent, it is not your effort it is you're unconscious you're unconscious unconscient you are science sinus snoring sleeping okay science that's the only way they can operate on you is in the unconscious other than that you know what i mean they're not gonna you, you have conscious and they have to take they have to it can only operate with your consent when you're conscious. That's even Lucifer. You know what I mean? Like that, that's that's consent and and yeah. That, Adam, when when Eve was made, that was not his consent. Do you understand? He was unconscious. The spirit cloud came over him and put him to sleep. Unconscious, unconsent. All right. And Eve was produced. She was deoxyed out of his rib, ribonucleic acid. Okay, why, why? He's the alpha oxy, ribonucleic. Okay, X, Y. Made in the image of God and such and such. Russian doll, keep on going. Beginning of, okay. There's heaven's legions, there's the legions of God, but then there's also the, the counterfeiting copy of the legion legends you know what i mean like i said things that are on earth and of hell you know what i mean they can only be produced after what comes out of the mouth you know what i mean so if the dragon controls your mind then they're gonna produce dragon stuff out of your mouth if the most high produce controls your mind and a lot of people are in denial about that you can't like look man even when 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 I don't like to contradict myself, but no man is perfect. So it, you're automatically within a contradiction in the first place, fighting your way out, knowing it's half the battle. And I'm just letting you know, I know the way. So I know how I got here. I know how to get out. I see a lot of people in here. If I never came here, you would not have me to tell you. You know what I mean? But I have a, a, a invested interest in you know, can I learn or can I help is the way out. <laughs> what do you mean? So if if you got ears, I got two feet. Listen to the steps and we're on the way. All right. Following blindly, you listen. Listen to the steps, man, because it's being told to us, it's being taught to us, it's being showed to us. <sighs> It's not going to be around forever like this. We're not going to be able to talk to each other. We're not going to be able to pep each other up and prep each other up like this. You know what I mean? You need to, you're going to have to get the word, hold on to it, and learn to live with it. You know what I mean? It's like when they say take life by the horns or something like that, you need to, take, you need to, you know, or he's, when Trump say grab life by the freaking Nike nookie, you know what I mean? The naked, you know what I mean? The nigga, grab it by the nigga, you know what I mean? And that's how, he, that's how he won the vote. But anyway, Nike. Victory. Check. Okay. Swoosh. All right.
swooshing victory. So yeah, man, to the wiener goes the vagina victory. Okay, yeah. Anyway, royal, royal ass. That's that's the way that Nike would be. Yes. Okay. Democrat. Mm, uh, donkey. Republican. Mm, uh, elephant. Okay. So. Um. And you notice a lot of people came over too, from. Yeah. So yeah, that that's the Nike part. Naked. Yeah. 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 People got found naked, and they had to come on over. Come. Yeah, swoosh. Grab him by the book. Yep, that's how he did him. He, if he does it one way, that's his way of seeing it in all ways. That's, that's all you got to understand about their type of people. That, that That's the way Legion goes. If they find a crack, they're going to exploit that and rinse and repeat that. Offer it as fresh. And it's going to be just their little niche, their little nook. Their little nick, uh, nickel, thrifty, yeah. So, enough, bro, enough. I'm just saying, man, you guys got to understand when you're being mocked to your face. They're, they're mocking people to your face to mock people to your face to mock you to your face. Like, they, they use a condom with a condom to, 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 to touch you, to give you the truth. And you don't even see it, obviously. It's deep cover. Like I said, it's the wizard in Oz. It's the curtain in Oz. Yeah, you're in Oz. You're lucid dreaming. But there is something deeper. Yeah, there's the, there's the wizard. Once you pull that back, now you're in the deep of the deep. All right? Once you throw in water on witches, and now you're in the deep of the deep. You're in, you know, you're in those corners, the caps, the out of bounds. Because they got that as private property. Prime real estate. Prime property. You know. You know. We got this common, you know, let's say public, common versus private. You know. So you got government, but then you got private government. You know what I mean? People that it's privileges. Anyway. So, at the end of the day, that's how you got to look at it, bro. You're going to have to look at it as they're, they're going to, they're using, it's, it's a conversation topic and a piece, it's a distraction, but it's, they use the truth to give you a distraction because when you're fumbling with it because you didn't expect it. And you argue about what it is, what what it isn't. It only works in their favor. Like I said, man, you gotta you gotta have it all uh, memorized and ready to go. You gotta be committed. You can't be like forgetting that this is the this is the goal is to you know have this have your word in order. That's your house. If your word is not in order, then your house is divided and it's and it's destroyed. The word is is it has to be put in order so that it is yielded. If it's not in order, it's going to be a you're going to you're going to have a mad house, a mutually assured destruction. Come on, sign up for MAD, MAID, made. They're going to do it to you like that. They made you do it. Oh shit. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and call it a day. I'm going I'm to come up with another video whenever the, the Ruach hits me. I, I think I got another one in the, ready to go. It's just this one was just was a baton that was just handed off. All right. On that note, or it was dropped and I picked it up and ran with it. All right. To the Rabbah Hayash, our high Kadosh, 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 to the Rabbah Shai, Kadosh, 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 to the Rabbah Hebruah, Kadosh, 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 to the Rabbah Hebruah, Kok Ma, Kadosh, 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 Asha Yashirun, Anami, Amen.